culture and the arts are part of um, the landscape that we inhabit. So many of the people who come to the Leadership Institute have, um, don't have an arts practice. Some of them have a very long arts practice. Some of them, it may be dance. Some of them, of them, it may be other artistic mediums. But we come together for 10 days to look at how the manifestations of racism may show up in our organizing when they're unexamined. And we look at it through two lens, internalized racial inferiority, how this affects people of color, internalized racial superiority, how this affects people we've come to be called people who are come to call white. So these things show up. So this is part of what we've been spending 10 days doing together. Day one, we don't know each other. We're getting to know each other. Day two, we get a little bit more knowing each other and we start to enter in the process of community building by looking at our workshop, entering, building, and exiting community. Day three and four, we go into understanding and undoing racism by People's Institute for Survival and Beyond. Day five, we start to look at the research around the work that we've been doing and the ways that people have been researching this on, our own, on their own along with prompts. Day six, we start to look at how we're integrating that in our bodies, in, our, in, our, in, in, in ways of making art. So day six, seven, and this is day nine, we are now presenting that to this community as a way of sharing how we've internalized this information, as well as our own practices. So I'm, I'm so happy that you're here to be part of this really wonderful, wonderful gathering. It's about 100 people, give or take a few, uh, that ha are part of the Summer Leadership Institute. It's held here in Brooklyn this year. For the last seven years, we've been in New Orleans. Uh, before that, we were in Tallahassee, Florida. Before that, we were in Brooklyn, New York. Then we were in Tallahassee, Florida. And now we are back to our home base of Brooklyn, Brooklyn New York, so we can share this with you. Thank you for being here. No.
hablar español es claro y suave como el acta de mi nacimiento es como un paseo en el parque mi manera de hablar inglés es tonto e inconcreto y mi acento lo hace aún peor es como escalar defensas con púas belong to neither. Two Americans should be smiling and should smile to be American. Where are you really from? Wow, your English is so good. You look so exotic. Oh, Somali Kohaba, speak your language. Doesn't cost you hardly Logan. Don't forget your culture. That can be American but the high, but you still just an American. Close another diaspora. We were scattered by war and bloodshed, dispersed all over the world, left wandering and lost. We are united by love for our motherland and longing for peace. Somalia Hanolako. Too much, too many deaths, too much grief, too many excuses and not enough questions, too common for a black life to be snatched away, and too many lynchings caught on video. Too often we hear, well, we don't really know what happened, too quick to say, can't we just move on? It's too much, and it's gone on too long. And still we hear, change takes time. Damn, it's been 
your vision, impact, and outcomes? How many people you will serve? Which community will your project impact? When your theory is changed, please submit your latest logic model. Your, I'll say procedural timeline. Submit separately a project timeline and budget, your most recent audit, and 501c3 designation from the government. Also submit your idea suggestion. What is your budget size? What's your award composition? Your cover letter should be no more than five pages max. Okay. 11 point font, no caret. In English, online, PDF only, no phone calls. Incomplete applications are not accepted. Your deadline is. At risk? Yes. Marginalized? Yes. Low income and first in the family? Thank you. 
say my test scores are lower than average, but I can feed a family of seven off some ground beef and some cabbage. See, that too is mathematics. Economics and logic, they asking me for letters of recommendation when my people built nations way before them plantations, meaning my nature can't be placed where you check your race on a piece of paper. They want all of my accumulated knowledge distilled on an application for some college that I may not get into because of the life I have lived through, and that's only if they even allow me to apply. They won't accept my submission because my essay's not scripted. The interview ain't an interview, so they skipped my attempt and dismiss it as a wish. Could care less about any intelligence that I've got. And these white folks mad like I'm taking their kid's spot. They want to know what kind of books I read and how I write so they'll know if I'm Hunger Games or if I'm more like Hunger Strike. Will I be a good girl and make proud my race or will I be a troublemaker that they got to put in her place so it's best not to chance defeat Best not practice, best not try, because the answer is always the same. It's access denied. Talking about hey now, hey now, hey now, hey now. I go, I go on day. Anande. Jacques and Mofino on day. Talking about hey now, hey now, hey now. I go, I go on day. 
Jaki mo fino anande, Jaki mo finande. My papa and your papa were sitting by the fire. My papa told your papa, we got to lift these children high. We're talking about hey now, hey now, hey now. Hey now. Hey now. I go, I go one day. Jackie Mofino Anande, Jackie Mofino Anande. Jackie Mofino Anande, Jackie Mofino Jackie Mofino I remember we would play outside all day. We didn't have no problems, no worries. See, braiding hair was how I made my money. Or occasionally babysitting a baby. Call me a hopeless romantic, but I remember when good people love good people. See, love was the connection, and it was free. See, it wasn't about the money. Patience was the key to our story, and to God went all the glory. What happened to you and me? This is some strange scenery. This is some strange scenery. Now, brothers are banging on the block trying to not get stopped by the cops, and the madness don't stop. Babies are having babies and hurting other babies, and nobody cares about a thing except the money, the sex, the cause, the bling, the money, the sex, the cause, the bling, the money, the sex, the cause, the bling, the money, the sex, the cause, the bling. Where did our future go? I really want to know, can somebody tell me what happened to our story? What happened to our history? Black 
freedom when black women, they're six times more likely than white women to be incarcerated. And one in every 15 black men are incarcerated. I'm taking back my freedom. I said I'm taking back my freedom. What is the meaning of freedom when all over this country, black communities and communities of color 
The union of sounds, movements, and rhythms. Feet caressing the earth, hips shaking it, hands floating like leaves. Our vibration sets all across continents and seas. Land, water, air, for we are conductors channeling the spirit of life. Ooh. Ooh. Thank you. 
you to the fabulous participants in the 2016 Summer Leadership Institute.
Institute. It's around this time of year. We'll be back in Brooklyn. So we hope to see you there. Thank you for being here. Yeah.